Hi guys and welcome to Laura's Keto Way of Life. Today I'm taking you on a trip to my local Audi store to see what goodies I can grab that are keto friendly and I'm so glad at the moment they had a health and fitness special on. So I thought I'd take you guys along. It's midweek. I know I can't get enough of shopping for food but they had some great specials on keto friendly food, health foods and fitness so I thought I'll go check it out. So of course my children lately have been loving tuna which is great because I do not <laughs> for some reason I still cannot eat tuna. It reminds me of when I was nine years old and I had to feed my cat its fish food every night. Oh I can't stand this smell but nevertheless I bought them because the kids love them which is great because tuna is high in protein. Also this is where I buy my organic coconut oil from. I love Audi's organic coconut oil so I didn't need any this week but I thought I'd show you. I also buy my apple cider vinegar from Audi as well. It's only $4.95 which is also a great price. Also I'm going to try the coconut cream. I've got a container at home that is unused so I'm going to think of a recipe I can use this week for this coconut cream. So I won't grab one of them. Of course I had to grab some cat food for my new little kitty called Gypsy. If you haven't seen her you'll have to check out my previous vlogs. She's cute. So what else? Oh this was my favourite section. So these are the health food smoothie section powders. <laughs> Um, paleo protein mix I found this this looked awesome very low carb very low sugar paleo free and it's gonna be great for garnishing on top of my smoothies so I thought well I'll give this a try it was very cheap as well I think it was only $4.95 and the ingredients were just seeds and almonds they had heaps of protein additive powders like the greens powder which was made out of where is it? <laughs> uh, barley and wheatgrass and also contains stevia. So that was very low carb and no sugars so I grabbed one of them. I looked at this until I saw that the carbs were very high so I thought no I won't grab that one I'll see what else other options they had. It had the beetroot powder which looked very interesting. It was low in sugar but very high in carbs as we know for our rooted vegetables. So that was a no. And I found some maca powder. Now the maca powder is really good to keep your hormones balanced and also for your sex drive and gives you amazing energy. It wasn't so high in carbs or sugar but it wasn't low either. So I also found the spirulina powder. That was similar to the greens powder. After looking at the ingredients and the nutrition information, I thought I would put the spirulina powder back and grab the maca powder instead. So they were a good price, they were $5.99. Um, you only need a teaspoon apparently per smooth. You can also use them in cooking. The fruit and nut mix, the very popular Audi's organic natural fruit and nut mix. Oh, how I love the nuts, but not the fruit. So that stayed there. I've been dying to find these coconut, coconut chips. Yes. Sorry about that. <laughs> so the organic coconut chips, they also had shredded coconut, but I've been looking everywhere for cheap organic coconut chips that were organic, 100% coconut, you know, low carb, low sugar great snacks. They're only 200 calories per 30 grams and that is a lot when these things weigh nothing. So I definitely grabbed a bag of them. Moving on, this section was amazing. So many health foods and I found coconut oil spray. This was a great find because I haven't really seen this much in Audi or Coles. So I hope we'll work, uh, sorry, I hope Audi stock this all the time. So I grabbed one of them. Um, Audi also sell avocado oil as well and I saw these little things called organic balls for peanut and cacao balls and then I turned over the back and they were high in carbs and sugar so I definitely put them back um, a lot of people have been advertising this tonic water 
I've seen on some keto pages so I thought I'd have a look and the sugars were so high in this I think it was 20 grams per serve ridiculous stay away from that So this was supposed to be a quick little stop in so I could buy some health food products but you know Audi's Health and Fitness was a great shop today. There were so many things to look at. I bought some new gym gloves. I found a book about super grains. How eating grains will make you feel better. I had to have a sneak peek and then realized no way would I ever have this book in my pantry at home. Um, yes, so there were so many things. There was, you know, rollers, there was protein powders, there was fitness equipment, gym bags, so many recipe books. It was, it was great. Um, this protein powder I was really interested in getting. It was 100%, you know, gluten-free, only whey protein, fast release. But something was telling me not to buy it. So I had a look at the ingredients on the back and it seemed healthy enough but there was still a lot of chemicals in the nutrition list that I did not really like so I thought you know what I'm happy with my pea plant-based protein powder that I'm using and as I said I'm only using protein powder maybe one smoothie a week at the most just to fill me up if I'm having you know a light dinner or something like that so after checking out this protein powder, it did look really good. As I said, there was no nasties, no GMOs or healthy nutrients, but there were some ingredients in there that I still didn't, you know, want to drink. So that was also $40. I didn't buy that one this time. Fruit and veg section. Obviously, I stayed away from the fruit. Sorry about that bad angle. Goodness. So I grabbed some Radox bath salts because they're really good for soothing muscles and I also grabbed a coffee scrub, exfoliation scrub as well. Now I'm going through so many eggs in a week, it is crazy and I grabbed a dozen today and probably in three days I'll go back and grab another dozen of eggs. My doctor said it's fine to have four eggs a day so I'm not going to argue with that. I'm going to keep making my omelettes, keep having my fried eggs with dinner and poached eggs with bacon. My other favorite section of Audi is the cheese section. Um, I didn't really need any cheeses at the moment. I used all the mascarpone last night, but I didn't grab anything new today. Mozzarella is my favorite cheese. This is the cheese I always buy. Um, it goes well with dishes. You can eat it out of the packet. You can, you know, melt it, eat it cold. It goes with salads. I use mozzarella all the time. And this is the mascarpone cheese that I buy to use for my mac and cheese cauliflower. Just in case you're wondering where I get it from. I also buy the Audi creams, the Audi milks. Um, they don't have the almond and coconut milk that I use. I actually buy that from Woolworths. But all the other cheeses, I'm happily, I'm happy enough. I happily enough buy them from Audi. I'm so sorry guys, I apologize for my camera angle being shocking. By this time my basket was full, I'm trying to film everything on my phone without people staring at me. Oh, I apologize. Um, I also use the Audi butter, it doesn't matter what butter I buy as long as it's, you know, butter. Um, Audi also have organic butter as well, which you can buy, but it's a bit more expensive. Bacon, I love bacon, but at the moment after researching a lot of bacon lately, I found out that Dectrose is in a lot of bacon. Now Dectrose is corn and I didn't realize that until I looked it up. So the only bacon I've found that doesn't have Dectrose in it is Hans. Hans or Hans, however you say it. But that meat company is the only company 
that I have found so far that sells bacon without dextrose in it. So sorry Aldi bacon, I won't be buying you anymore. Um, I do love Aldi's vegetables. They're cheap and they are good. They're always fresh. I've never had an issue. Um, I didn't need any veggies today, but I actually did lie. I went back and grabbed a zucchini. I have a zucchini a day. Um, I love zucchinis. It's a great green low carb veg. If you haven't tried them, try a zucchini. You can bake them in the oven with like a lasagna dish or just cut them up, fry them in butter with some pumpkin. That's what I've been doing lately. So as you will see in this video, I have grabbed a tray of zucchinis and I will also grab a butternut pumpkin as well. Um, I like Audi's mints. They do have a big variety of mints and I also buy the chicken thighs from Audi as well. Um, they have organic mints, which is really good and it's good price as well. So you can buy just, you know, they've got the plain high fat mints or they've got organic mints. They've also got chicken as well mints. Um, I buy the tray of the chicken thighs as well for my stir fries and things like that. They also sell uh, rocket and baby spinach in bags. You know, you can grab your cabbage and it's not too expensive. So I am grabbed half a butternut, butternut pumpkin. I think it was $1.80, which was good. So my other favorite thing at the moment for my snacks and desserts is strawberries. I love strawberries. They're very low in carbs and sugar and calories. So I normally have two strawberries a day. Um, I love mushrooms. I probably have mushrooms twice a week in omelets or something like that. And this is what I was telling you the other day. When I'm out and about, I have no lunch on me, I have no food, and I'm like, oh, what do I get? There's no takeaway food. I will come to Audi and go to their salad section and just look for packaged salads. I love the um, Caesar salad packet, which is here. It's only $3.99 and it is a massive salad. Yep, there it is, the Caesar salad kit. Of course, I don't eat the croutons and I don't eat the sauce, but I love the little bacon pieces and the parmesan flakes and cos lettuce. So if I'm out and about, you know, I don't want a bad meal, I'll just grab a bag of salad from Audi. They also have this family size salad mix as well. I can devour. <laughs> so I have filled my basket up with stuff, even though I was going for three things. As usual, I always say that, that I'm just going to Audi to grab a couple of things or I'm just going to Woolworths to grab a couple of things. And, you know, I spend 40 minutes in here. Like today I spent 40 minutes in Audi and I just went crazy on their health food, you know, keto friendly things, which was good. Um, I had to get the kids like box packs as well, as you can see, and their Vegemite. They love their Vegemite on toast. Um, I used to eat Vegemite all the time, as I've told you before. I used to eat around six slices of bread a day with in Vegemite. So that's it. That is my keto haul from Audi. I'm so sorry about the shaky video. I'm sorry about the bad footage. But as I said, it was all filmed on my phone. It was pouring rain. I was carrying a basket full of goodies, my umbrella, my Audi bag. And I'm glad I got to film it without any controversy of people saying, what are you doing in here? Hi guys, so another day over. I did go to Audi on my lunch break as you saw, but I just want to do a quick little snippet to say, oh, when I get them, these things are delicious. Um, I've been looking everywhere for coconut flakes. I didn't want to spend the whole crazy $12 and things like that, that um, a lot of health food stores sell them. But if you have not tried these Audi brand organic coconut chips, you got to try them. They are an amazing snack. As you can see, cute, yummy little flakes in there. They taste awesome. They are dry, but it says they're chips and they're just like thin, like air fried chips. Mm. And I've eaten a quarter of the bag already. That is crazy. But just wanted to say, for my drive home, I know what I'm going to be snacking on today. So um, yeah, when I get home, I'll show you my little Audi haul that I did today. And it was all under $30. Hi guys, I'm home from another day at work. And as usual, I went and did my little grocery haul on my lunch break. So this week at Audi was all about health and fitness. I love how Audi change up their different topics each week. 
different you know ranges of foods or products and things like that so I was so excited when I saw the magazine last week that this week was gonna be health and food and health and fitness and health foods and whole foods and a lot of paleo products so I raced down there at lunchtime today and I grabbed a lot of my health food options and I made sure everything that I brought was keto friendly so I thought why not show you guys what I grabbed okay so I got my farm fresh eggs these delicious organic coconut chips oh they're so hard to not stop at a handful <laughs> um they had gym gloves there so i brought some gym weightlifting gloves which are really cheap too they're only eight dollars this for me time later on that's a coffee body scrub so you just use a little bit in the shower great for de-stressing exfoliating and you know rehydrating your body my other favorite muscle soother is Radox bath salts. So they're great to shove in the bath after a busy weekend. This, which I'd never knew Audi sold. So I don't know if it's because of health food week, but coconut oil spray. Oh, I've been looking for this for ages and I didn't want to spend a million dollars on them. So I brought the Audi one today. Butternut pumpkin because I'm really loving zucchini and but butternut pumpkin fry ups at the moment. So I just use a little bit and it's really filling. My natural ingredient protein shake powders at, at the moment. So I brought some maca powder. So maca powder is really good for um, hormonal balance to balance out the hormones and really give you a lot of energy. I brought this paleo protein mix. It looks yummy. It's a mix of seeds and almonds. And I was happy that, you know, each 30 gram serving was no sugar pretty much and low carbs. Um, another thing to add to my protein smoothies um, or to food is the greens powder. So this is, you know, yummy healthy greens to fix your digestive system, to just, you know, flush out your body, add some good antioxidants, which is, you know, wheatgrass, barley grass, stevia containing. Um, it's also great for weight loss as well, you guys. These things are amazing for weight loss. Um, my thing I'd be lost without, butter. I bought some tuna. Not that I eat tuna, but my children have started loving tuna. So I stocked up on tuna. My favorite that I have once a day, pretty much in all my meals, is zucchini. And the boring stuff, cat food, and some ice packs for the kids' lunch boxes. So that was my little grocery haul from Audi today, and that was only thirty dollars. So if you, I don't know if all these products are always available, but this week was health and fitness week at Audi. So get down there this week, guys, if you can, to your local Audi and check out what they've got. I hope they do keep these things in stock because they were six dollars each packet, but you know you only use a tablespoon each shake that you make. Um, so that's my haul. Um, I hope you all have a great week. Stay healthy, stay fit, and just enjoy life.